Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Benfica up against Inter. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And this is how the starting eleven looks for Benfica. Joao Mario starts with David Neres out wide. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. This is how it looks for Inter. Milan Striniar plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Edin Dzeko. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Florentino. Rafa and with it Joao Mario Rafa and just leaning back a bit and over the bar Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, he's been brilliant for them. He's their leading goal scorer, and his general play in the top third of the pitch has been so clever. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. There's a slide rule pass. Well, no examination at all for the goalkeeper, and on that basis, he's going to be a bit cross with himself. Grimaldo it's with Rafa given away by Benfica Barella Dzeko now with Mkhitaryan Federico Di Marco This might be ideal for the counter. Well, he's got past his man. Rafa. Opportunity. And saved by the keeper.
short option preferred. Otamendi. Could be. Still possibilities. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Well, I still don't know how he kept that out, Derek. It's a fantastic save to keep it all square. Well, in possession now and looking to create something of their own. It did look on for them, but not to be. Rafa. Frederik Aursnes. This is looking threatening. Determined defending. Aursnes. Gonzalo Ramos. Joao Mario. Rafa. The supporters want to see him have a go. Can he open the door to a potential goal? A goal! The opening statement of the match. A richly deserved lead. And now they can celebrate. Well, here it is again. And credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next oh. making use of his physical strength to hang on to it the high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle Rafa Well, half-time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Mkhitaryan. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Martinez. Now with Barella. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Well, it looks highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Joao Mario. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. An incisive pass. That's all they can conjure for now. Dzeko. I must say, this looks promising. Well, it could be on for him here. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Short corner favourite. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in.
Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. The high press was on, and the chance is on. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Playing it short. David Neres. And quite simply, wide of the target. Martinez it's with a chair beat and he was in the right place to intercept and space to cross it and a significant block following that cross Chalhanolu and blocked for now <laughs> substitution time it is here But he's gone short with it. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Who's going to get on the end of it? And still dangerous. Well, they can keep possession now. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Not the best challenge, free kick. Here it is now, a substitution. Geddes, bad pass. Well, he's been forced out of play this time. Gozens. Now Jekko. Miki Tarian. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Oh, a penalty! Not at all what they wanted, with time running out. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. They will now make use of their substitute's bench. An opportunity to level matters. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. Back underway, following the equaliser. Frederick Aursnes. Otamendi has it. 
Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Joao Mario and return to Gedge. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Well, that could be the final warning. Well, he needs to be careful now. Next foul, and it's a card. And there's the referee's whistle, still all square.